North Korea has a vast array of missile bases and missile forces. They deploy about 300 short and medium range ballistic missiles. These operational missile bases that we have been looking at, about 20 of them, are arrayed in three strategic belts. And the belt that's highest, that's closest to China, we think have long range uh, ballistic missiles. Yusang Ni Missile Base is located in central North Korea. And this makes it different from many of the other bases. A base like Yusang Ni houses the delivery systems that can reach the United States. The indications we have that are seen in satellite imagery are the size of the facility. It's actually quite large. We also see several unique features of it, one of which is a drive-through hardened facility. Associated with this is what we call an underground facility. Think of a tunnel that goes through a mountain, but it's not just a tunnel. Inside this tunnel is a cavern where you store the missiles, where you store the launchers, and it's of a size that is much larger than existing short-range ballistic missiles. The unit based at Yusangni is at least a brigade and potentially a division level unit. This is significant because North Korea doesn't have that many units of this size. We see people moving around the entire facility. More recently, we've seen actual troops on parade. Also at the headquarters area, we see a soccer pitch and we see people moving around on it. The problem is that the North Koreans to this day do not acknowledge having any of these bases. It's very difficult to negotiate with a counterpart over something that they do not admit having. This is important in terms of the broader policy because none of these missile bases are part of any negotiation, as far as we can tell, between the Trump administration and the North Korean regime.